let's get this day let's get this day started oh there's a small buck over there cool let's see if I can go get close to him oh he's gonna cross okay let's see wow so cool what's going on beautiful people it's yet another perfect day to go fishing and the fish are going to be biting today. I could just feel it. Trying a new spot out. And <clears throat> hopefully I can land a few and then maybe take them home and do a little catch and cook. But it all depends on what the river will give me. So let's go have another fun and interesting time down the river on the kayak. So far, the leaves... And the amount of leaves has gone way down. So I think today will be a lot better compared to a couple weeks ago. Just because I don't have to fight all the leaves this time. Oh, there we go. Oh. oh. <clears throat> I've also learned that you have to cast at an angle or you're guaranteeing some kind of hookup in the trees. Oh, there we go. Yep. <sighs> okay, fish on the board. Cool. That didn't take more than a couple minutes. Let's see, let's see. Come on, Bubba. Nice. Not a bad one to start the day. Okay, let's see. Let's get him out. So I'm starting the day off with a rainbow setup spinner and we'll see how that goes. Got a couple of bites and then I got a, I landed one, that was pretty sweet. And I'm trying to fish backwards, <laughs> go figure. Oh, there's a little otter right next to me. Maybe he's hoping I'll catch something for him. There we go. Oh, wow. Oh my gosh, that was awesome. Come on, buddy. Oh, beautiful fish. Beautiful. Oh man, look how fat it is too. Oh, nice. Okay, Bubba, we'll see ya. Oh, there we go. Oh yeah, that was a good hit. Okay, 
Come here, Bubba. Man, for a little guy, that was a good hit. Come here, dude. Cute little fella. Well, if there's anything I've learned from all this kayak fishing this year, is that you can kind of get wherever you want to go but you're also in moving water, which makes it very interesting and very unpredictable. However, you're also on a floating vessel, which means when you stop paying attention, you are going all over the place. It also makes for some very interesting lure retrieval if you get caught in the branches which I've done many times this year. For the most part, I was able to get a lot of them back. I've lost, oh, there we go, there we go. Oh, dang it. I've lost all kinds of things, uh, including a actual fishing pole when I was first getting into the kayaking, but that was because I had a dog on board. That didn't make sense. I've lost a pole. I've lost plenty of tackle. Caught some great fish. I had a blast doing it. My goal is to get an actual fishing kayak and continue doing this. Okay, damage report. Um, looks like I'm out of fishing pole again. Even though I was literally just talking about that. Uh, I think I lost the tackle, which that's kind of a bummer. But I did find my oars. They're, uh, they're right here. So, nice little impromptu swimming session for the day. I think that will conclude this fishing experience, unfortunately, because I cannot catch a fish without a pole. So now I gotta figure out how I'm gonna get this oar and then have the wife come pick me up. So, all in all, pretty successful day, I think. Just, uh, had to cut it short. Go do some fall swimming. All right. When I get some stuff back, we'll go fishing again. It's never, there's never a dull moment. Well, when you're fishing with Frank, that's for sure. Sometimes I catch the good size. Sometimes I catch nothing but little fellas. And sometimes 
I decided to go swimming at the uh, end of November. So with that being said, I hope you guys enjoyed this video. I'll be back on the water again uh, once I dry out and get warm and once I get some more tackle. So I'll see you all next time. What do we have here, baby? I think I found it. Oh, okay. Whew. All good things.